Welcome back, gamers. Lazy gamer here. Uh, lazy gamer. Lazy gamer here. Yeah. And let's play some more Fallout New Vegas. And it's 1500 hours just about. And we are at the Great Khan settlement. The NCR wanted us to either annihilate, annihilate them or uh, neutralize them. I am trying to make them join us. We shall see how that goes. Why is it so bright? I'm not even... Probably the sunlight then. Here we go. Are you planning to ally with the NCR? Is that why you're running these errands for them? Yeah, why? Well, I'm not excited about getting involved in this war. And I wish we didn't have to do it. And I probably don't even need to say this, but if we have to get involved, I want to fight with the NCR. Alright. Um, yeah. Thank you! How many do you have for me? Alrighty. I'm ready. Let's go. I have a feeling you should uh, be wearing your armor, Willow. Alright, if you find that better, more suitable, I guess. <clears throat> There are lots of tents, but I think we are looking for a house. There should be one house here. A hut. Whatever the case may be. I think, I think it might be up there. I'll figure it out somehow. Hi. So the NCR makes peace with the kings now? Well, we go here and then. Here. Right. <clears throat> Good plan. Good plan. Um, we'll only figure. Hey, here we go. Fire and stuff. Well, they're not shooting me. What is my. Hmm. Well, Boomers, Brotherhood, well, Devil Figure, Liked, Accepted, Idolized, Accepted. So, <clears throat> we can do stuff to remedy that. I, <clears throat> I like the cons, even though they tried to shoot me. Well, they didn't. Benny did. He's dead, so... Hi! Ah! Actual lights! How wonderful! Um... I've been warned. You are perilously close to making an enemy of Caesar, and that is not wise. So what do you think of the Khan? Uh, who are you? My name is Carl. Glorious Caesar has sent me as an emissary to the great Khans as a token of our alliance. What alliance? In exchange for great Caesar's promise of all the lands west of New Vegas, the Khans have agreed to fight alongside the Legion when the time comes. 
And your own this is... I am one of the Frumentari. It is my duty to scout the waste in Caesar's name and make contact with any tribes that might serve a useful purpose. You might say I'm somewhere between a scout and an ambassador. I'm assigned here as part of the <coughs> alliance between the Legion and the Great Khans. I see. Though they have been cruelly oppressed by the NCR, the Khans remain great warriors. The Legion is honored to have such allies in battle. Speak then. They're a tribe of fine warriors with many proud traditions and a glorious history. They will be worthy additions to the Legion. All right. Yes, goodbye. I wonder. Yeah, I... Just gonna pick that up. Let's have a quick look. And they all saw me go in there. So probably saw what I did, but who cares. Um, radio. Carl's journal. This journal consists of... Consists... Once, one more time. This journal <laughs> consists of a detailed recording and observations from Carl's time with the Great Khans. Many of the entries goes into great detail about his opinion of the savages, barbarous customs, and at several points he waxes philosophic. Philosophic. He does? About <laughs> how it's very likely that this Caesar's Legion will have to execute a lot of them. He. Okay. Hi. So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? Have you now? Hmm. Well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Caesar is only using you. No. Ha! <laughs> the great Khans will not be slaves. Caesar himself has promised us the land from here to the Colorado and the freedom to raid as we see fit. I won't hear any more talk against Caesar or his alliance. The great Khans will answer Caesar's call to war, and the NCR will pay for their crimes. You want to hear the story of the great Khans? It's a long one, full of honor, glory, and betrayal. We have suffered, but we will regain our glory. In a hurry, are you? Very well, then. The Great Khans came east, out of the NCR, 14 years ago. We ruled the wastes then, and called no man master. But we underestimated the families of the Strip, and they drove us back to Bitter Springs, where we remained until the NCR arrived and drove us here. Typical. You march all the way out to Red Rock Canyon, enter my home as bold as you please, and you have no idea who I am? You've got guts, I'll give you that. Yep. Well then, let me educate you. I am the chief of the great Khans, the Khan of Khans, if you like. This is my tribe, and these are my people. Okay. Farewell. I'm feeling I should have more options here. Caesar's veterans will arrive from Arizona soon, and there will be no stopping our victory. So you say, but... Yes, goodbye. Hi. I haven't seen you before. What brings you to the Great Khans? That's a complicated question. They've done horrible things to our people, to be sure, and I've gladly killed many of their soldiers in battle. But I can't bring myself to hate them the way Papa does. Things would damn sure be better for us if they were in charge than Caesar. I suppose if asked, I would. But that's a moot point, because Papa's in charge now, and he's not going anywhere. Ah. 
I need this quest first, maybe. Papa is one of the best leaders the Khans have ever had. He's kept us together through all of our hardships, ever since we left California. Bitter Springs changed him, though. He started to really hate the NCR after the massacre. And sometimes, I worry that's poisoned his mind. Sure. Go. See ya. Until next time. So I can't really... You've been doing good things for us. Don't think I haven't noticed. What can I do for you? I... let's see. Quest... So I go... I have to go back and talk to her, do I? I heard you try to convince Papa Khan not to join with Caesar's Legion. I'd like to talk to you about that for a moment. You could close your mouth, you know? Uh, what is it you had in mind? You want to convince Papa not to ally with Caesar, right? Trust me, you'll get nowhere just talking to him about it. He's fixated on restoring the glory of the great cons, and he sees Caesar as the path to that restoration. So? Papa can be a stubborn man, but he's not a tyrant. He listens to his tribe, and to four voices in particular. Me, Jack, Diane, and Melissa. If you can convince all of us that allying with Caesar is a bad idea, you might be able to sway him. All right. You'd have to talk to them, but those two have been thick as thieves since they were kids. Convince one, and the other will come around. All right. Ah, Melissa. She's a bit of a dreamer. Last time she was in camp, Carl filled her head with stories of serving the Legion as a speculatore. Personally, I've never seen a woman in Legionnaire's armor, so I have my doubts. Only as... Uh, ...disposables, I should say. Horse and such. Alright. Good. Oh, one more thing. Caesar's representative, Carl has become fast friends with Pava. Carl's the one who has him so fixated on this alliance. You'll probably have an easier time of things if you can find a way to get him out of the picture. How would I do that? Carl talks prettily about the honor and nobility of the great cons, but I suspect his actual opinion is less flattering. Maybe you could find something he wrote that expresses that opinion, or trick him into losing his cool in the longhouse right in front of Pava. I'll keep that in mind. I would too, if I were you. All right. Now we are cooking with charcoal, I think. Diane's going nuts trying to find a new contact in the fiends now that Motor Runner's dead. Uh, sorry about that. <laughs> Uh, it wasn't me, honest. Hey. Ah, you're back. What else do you need? Uh, you should look at this. It's Carl's journal. And, well, just see for yourself. Let me see that. Filthy savages. Probably have to decimate the lot of them. Are these the words of our friend, Caesar? No. Bring cons. Drive Caesar's dog out of our camp. If he's too slow to flee, kill him. Not so tough now. <laughs> well, his clothes is probably dirty with all that. It's gorgeous here. This may be the most beautiful place I've seen in all my time on the road. Except you, of course. Um, now what we're doing? 
Uh, convince. All right. Convince three other people, and we have to talk to Colonel Moore about it. But I think we have to turn him around first. So let's look at these people we are talking to. Two of them are sort of. Uh, In, uh, I think they are closest. Let us go and see if we can't find them. They're, they are in a separate valley behind here. But I sort of never really remember how to get there. It's probably not this way. I have to go down and around. Yep, because we are at a high place right now. This is uh, fairly defendable. I'll give them that. Yeah, uh, cons are not the most stupid of the raiders. They're not bad to have at your side. So they are easily bought so. as there we go I think um, if you just want to use step aside <laughs> go much, much easier um, I think is yes I is right. We shall have a discussion because I'm so good with that. Hmm. Let's see. Hi. Her, I need to get proof. I can talk him around. Hi. Hey, look who it is bringing that good con karma around. Uh, well, let's just jump right to it, huh? Huh? Look, kitty cat, me and Diane, we don't dig on that politics stuff, savvy? We just make the product and make it get to a good home. Sure, Caesar's a drag, but as long as we got each other, we don't care who the top dogs roll with. But you won't have each other, the Legion will kill you and sell Diana into slavery yeah that's true dude what a total haul no way that's copa she she yeah okay me and diane got your back no sweat cool uh you're doing drugs and i'm in the ncr but i'm not gonna take it easy kitty cat and i think those are turned Melissa, though, that can be a slight problem. What? Oh, right. Hoover them. Hoover them. <sighs> we have to go back. And find her. And uh, I'm gonna tell you, it won't be very complicated to um, convince her. Hi, I think, uh, but it might be slight problem actually getting there <laughs> we shall find out I'll uh, meet you uh, close there yeah 
close to there. I'll be right back. Okay. So we are here and we need to get to there. That leads us back to Good Springs. I'm gonna check out this way. See where it goes. Well, I have a feeling I'm doing this a bit backwards. But hey! Whatever works. Well, we'll look at that at some point. Maybe. Let's see. Where are we at? Powder gang or something. Hope that didn't draw his attention. Yeah, I saw ya. It's one less. I did cool down my cyan, uh, my leveling slightly. <laughs> it's almost too late now. New era, no. do that. Or that. Or that. I saw you. I would 
say the nice shot, but as long as they explode, I don't think it really matters. <laughs> um, yeah. That is the problem, see? Well, you're still alive. Let's see how long that lasts. I'm not a coward. I'm just precautious. That's all. think I can get there from here anyway. So... Do you smell that? Oh, it's awful. Whoa. That was a mess. Let's ignore that. This could go backwards. I got in from the wrong direction. That's fine. Can handle it anyway. Bye. -bye. What just happened? Nothing. I'm certainly not here. You? Are you... immune to Explodium? I certainly would like to get them all, because if one of them gets close... <sighs> Call it cheating. If you want. I'll just be a bit careful with moving along, shall I? Sorry about that. Uh, just had to take care of a few more of those guys. Yeah, the person we're looking for is over there, but we are going to go slightly past to a place that Willow is not that fond of. But though I guess we're past all that now. This is Sloan. They have a death claw problem. I hope they don't close the quarry. I need the money. They already you know they they haven't closed it. Can't believe anyone actually made it through from the north, what with all the death claws at the quarry. You returning from New Vegas? Yeah, where did they come from? They moved into the quarry after the powder gangers came through and made off with most of our dynamite. 
We shut the quarry down while we waited for the NCR to get us some more blasting sticks. But now the death claws have shown up. The NCR is a no-show. And my men and I have got nothing to do but sit on our asses all day. It's damn frustrating. What's so wrong about that? I'll take care of it. I don't know what it is about you, but I think you could actually pull it off. Death Claws are tough bastards, but you might be even tougher. Nobody here is any use to you in a fight against Death Claws, but take these medical supplies. You'll probably need them. To do the job right, you've got to get rid of the pack leaders, the Mother Death Claw and the Death Claw Alpha Male. Should run the rest of them off. Okay. That, okay. I will do. See ya. If you insist on going north, don't be expecting a rescue when you get into trouble. I'll get. I'll get you out of trouble, shall I? Wish somebody could do something about his leg. Anything we can do here? Sloan? Ah, this is where the death claws are. We should leave now. Although we just fought like a million of them, we'll be fine. Oh, it's a, it, it's Snuffles. Who's Snuffles? Hi. Hmm. Your leg seems to be injured. All right. I'll get to that. How's it going? Bye. Yeah, just for kicks. That was nice of you. Well, thank you, Willow. I'll deal with you later, shall I? Hmm. Where? Oh, still there. Do you need something? We shut the qu Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's wrong. Oh. Wrong dialogue. I'd noticed Snuffles limping, but I didn't realize the problem was that serious. Thanks. That beast helps keep spirits up around here. Poor <laughs> pet. Yep. Uh, well, now I've seen everything. <sighs> well, we'll deal with the. Death Claws in the next episode <laughs> because I ran out of time. I heard that elite units are on the way to support our armies here. Well, maybe. Anyway, this has been your host, the Lazy Gamer. Logging off. Bye, guys. We can't sit idly while the Legion prepares their own elite forces. Are you gonna shut up?